Hello, welcome back to uh, MCAT Grind. We have Organic Chem, Chapter 9, Carboxylic Acid. Uh, the derivatives of carboxylic acid. I'm just going to write it right here. Derivatives. So, we have acyl halide, anhydride, carboxylic acid, ester itself, as well as amide. These are the common derivatives you will need to know, and reactivity is the highest for the acyl halide. Why? Because these are really good leaving groups the chloride, uh, bromide, iodide, and so on. Just a flashback, remember, the chloride are the easiest leaving groups if it's in uh, a presence in uh, hydro, uh, a solution with a lot of H. And another is, the other way is if it's an anhydrous uh, solution, it would be the other way, with I, iodide be the greatest leaving group. Then, what we have here is nucleo Philic acid substitution, very easy, you simply just substitute one into another using one of the uh, deprotonated uh, carboxylic acid hyd hydroxides as an uh, attacker, a nucleophile, and attack like the central carbonyl carbon and causing uh, happening for anhydride. So this anhydride, remember taking away H2O just makes it an anhydride between two carboxylic acids. Uh, amide can occur using anhydride by attacking using NH3 here on one of the carbonyl carbons and deriving it, or using ester by attacking carbonyl carbon and causing it to fall. And ester can form using another alcohol and just attacking the central carbon group and causing the the formation of an ester, yeah. And a reduction can happen for either amide or uh, ester into simpler forms. For uh, for amide, it turns into an amine. And for uh, esters, it turns in, into alcohol. And it's split into two alcohol, right? By adding H here and adding H here, turns into ethanol and a methanol here. Saponification is just like the simplification of using OH attacking group and dissociating it into uh, from a, tri a triple carboxylic acid and breaking the bonds. You can think of it just nucleophilic acid substitution in three uh, sequences. And that's pretty much it for the carboxylic acid derivatives.